Welcome to the Great Exodus series, God's plan for your rescue. Let my people go. The Great Exodus out of the world and out of Babylon. The path to Mount Zion. My name is Michael and I am the founder of Triple Grace and the Righteous Path Movement Foundation. <coughs> and today my voice is very bad, but that will not stop us. Our topic today is the dual pass over to heaven. What do I mean with the dual pass over to heaven? Did we not have a pass over to heaven in June? Yes, we had one from the 6th of June to the 13th of June, where I stated that the dead of Christ will start rising. And what will happen? We have a confirmation on this on the YouTube channel and on our website Triple Grace. There is a whole page dedicated to what has happened in the night between the 13th to the 14th of June. You can just go there and have a look. Please follow the links in the description box below to our website and also to support us in any way that you might can. It, it's possible for you. Donations or any other kind of support. But only if you are guided by the Holy Spirit. This is not a must for anybody. Everything that we provide is free. Let's come back to the topic of the dual Passover timeline. So we had this first Passover to heaven timeline and that was from the 6th of June to the 13th of June. But in the same pattern as the Jewish have a Passover and then 30 days later a second Passover for the people who are not in Jerusalem but in the diaspora, now you will also have the same with a dual Passover. There is a dual Passover timeline on YouTube from a beloved sister who made a clear understanding what will happen on the 17th of July. But this is not our Passover timeline. Our Passover is the Passover to heaven. It is seven days of staying without sin, seven days of worshipping the Lord, seven days of being very close with Him and with the Father, seven days of not bickering, seven days of not doing any bad things, seven days of staying out of immorality, seven days of helping other people more and more, so that you show forth your love to the Father. These seven days, the last seven days are now very, very important from the 6th of July to the 13th of July, because they are just before the escape of the bride on the 16th to 17th of July. Please join us. Be part of this second Passover to heaven. Don't worry if you have not taken part in the first Passover to heaven. This was just the beginning. Now we come to the, um, uh, to the completeness of the Passover to heaven. And everybody can take part. Please, in this time period, talk to the Lord every day. Either through prayers or by talking aloud to him and also to the father because he will guide you what to do he will guide you and he will let you know if you are part of the escape of the bride or if you will walk that path to mount zion and if you should walk that path to mount zion then come and join us join triple grace join us at our youtube channel share the videos subscribe like click the bell icon to get notifications and walk with that, that path to Mount Zion, so that you can be raptured into paradise with a multitude clothed in white. Because now in the escape of the bride, only very few people who are holy and without spot and wrinkle will go. And not many will do that. So the Lord has called me, was ten years ago, to prepare a new altar for these people who will remain. And this new altar is brought forth through the societies of the rose, where you have safe havens that will stay under the wings of the Father for protection, where mighty angels will come and guide you. You do not have to worry because they will be with you always. So join us. Be part of 
Purple Grace be part of the multitude closed in white, that will then be collected from the mighty angels from all societies of the rose and all the nations from all the four corners of the earth, and be taken to the base of Mount Zion. And there we will have access to the holy place of the Father. And we will be raptured into paradise. And a few of us who are willing to do the extra mile will then be sealed, be part of the 144,000, will continue their work during the time of trumpets, because the rapture of the church will take place at the sixth seal and at the place of Mount Zion. This is not Mount Zion in Israel. This is a mountain carved not by human hands. This is a holy mountain. And on that holy mountain, on the slope of that holy mountain, there will be all the mentions that Jesus has promised us. And you will receive your own mention if you walk with us that path to Mount Zion. Everything what I say is confirmed through the Bible. Read the book of Revelation. Listen to YouTube channels who promote 14 years instead of 7 years of end time timeline. Listen to the sisters who proclaim the 17th of July. All this is correct. But one thing I have to tell you here. If you do not believe that you will go into an escape or the rapture, then you will never go. It is a question of faith. You have to believe that you are part of it. And then, only then, can you walk that path. You have to take a leap of faith. We have made a whole video about it. Take a leap of faith. Look for it. It is in our Great Exodus series. Take a leap of faith and believe that you are part of it, that you are part of the family of true sons and daughters of the Most High of Yahweh. Walk with us that path. When darkness falls and judgment will strike, then I'm always here for you. I have told you that before. We are here for you. And take our hands and walk with us. Not everybody will go in the escape of the bride. And the rapture at, at Mount Zion into paradise will be the rapture of the church. Not all the church will go right now. So we are here for you. When you see that the escape has taken place, people have vanished and you were not part of it. And don't be discerned too much. Come, join us. Bring forth the societies of the rose, the assemblies of love and righteousness into your neighborhood. Gather the people, do the harvest work, and then you will be accounted worthy to go into the rapture of Mount Zion, the rapture at Mount Zion, the rapture of Yahweh, of the multitude, closed in white. So please take part now in the second Passover to Heaven week, from the 6th of July to the 13th of July. We will see another rising of the dead, and this time the dead will then help to collect in the last people for the bride. And then on the 16th to 17th we have the escape of the bride. Believe it. Show forth your faith in believing. Do not come against people, say, oh, this is wrong date setting, or this is wrong, what, whatever the case is. If you do not believe in it, you will never take part in it. So be sure that you believe and take a leap of faith. Stand against the, the majority who will say this will never happen. The majority is never right. So be part of the minority who takes a leap of faith and says, yes, I believe in the power of my Father, and I believe in the power of the Lord Jesus Christ. And he will come now in July, and he will take his bread. And I will be part of it. And if not, then I will join Michael and walk with him that path to Mount Zion. Because then I will receive the mention that I was promised. And we will gather the people and snatch the pearl from the dragon layers and bring as many people to righteousness as possible. That is written in Daniel 12.3. And by the way, it is not a coincidence that in Daniel 12.1 Michael will stand up, the archangel, because he will walk with us, and he will protect us, 
and he will guide us as he has guided in the first exodus the Israelites on their way to Mount Sinai. So now he will also guide us on our path to Mount Zion. So we are protected by the mightiest of angels. So do not worry, but take a leap of faith and believe, and then you will be set free. Free from the world, free from Babylon, then you will enter the heavenly kingdom. Thank you that you are listening to this message today and that you will take part in the second Passover to Heaven, our dual sec Passover to Heaven timeline from the 6th of July to the 13th of July by being without sin, talking to the Father and to Jesus and be very, very kind. Thank you that you listen to this message. My name is Michael. I'm the founder of Triple Grace and the Righteous Pass Movement Foundation, and we are always here for you. If you have any questions, just contact us at our ministry email, triplegrace55 at gmail.com. Join our website, triple slash grace.com, and be part of our growing member membership. Look at all the resources that we have up. Study the videos. See the teachings. Watch all the videos at our YouTube channel. If you're guided, support us in any way. For example, become a patron of Triple Grace at Patreon. The link is in the description box below. Help us to bring forth the messages to the world, to the nations. Help us in the mission to Cambodia. Help us with establishing societies of the rose, the assemblies of love and righteousness in the world. Help us with making videos. Assist us wherever you can. Because we are called forth to act as the assemblies in the book of Acts, who shared their resources and gave to the people who are in need, lifted up the needy, and supported the nameless and faceless. And you are part of this. And you will walk into your glory, the glory that will be given by the Father, by Yahweh, and His only begotten Son, Jesus Christ. So walk with us, be part of Triple Grace. Thank you that you are here for this message today. May God bless you and your family abundantly, and I will see you again tomorrow. Maranatha.